Hey, what's up? This is Storm Hunters, and this is a commentary of Mr. Beast React's new video. We found a list of the 30 coolest roller coasters in the world. That's a lot. Right off the bat here, I can probably guess that most of these aren't going to be actually true. This is the 30th coolest roller coaster in the world. Let's see what's so cool about it. Oh. So we're in uh, Six Flags Over Texas, and I can't remember the name of it, but there's nothing really special about this coaster. Oh. That's a pretty big drop. That, oh, all right. It's picking up steam. I like how you like get to go right beside the cars. Yeah. That's so cool. The loop-de-loop. -loop. Yeah. Oh, Another, the double loop. Do okay. Double loop scoop. That's rare to have a double loop. I a double loop is not very rare. Some parks even have multiple coasters that have double loops. You can see it's got a lot of cool stuff. It appears to be going pretty fast. Go I just wanted to say that I have nothing against Mr. Beast and his crew. I just wanted to clear things up for aspiring coaster enthusiasts. Uh, I am a coaster enthusiast and I know my stuff. So, yeah. Go kart track underneath it. I can see why this would be the 30th coolest roller coaster ever. This is the 29th coolest roller coaster in the world. Are you a fan of wood coasters? This um, actually is not a wood coaster. This is a Rocky Mountain construction hybrid coaster. It, it's usually commonly confused with wooden coasters, but it is actually a, the rails of the coaster are metal while the supports are wooden. They scare me. I like the scare though, because it feels like you could die. Oh my gosh, that's so steep for a as Chris is saying here, it is steep for a wooden coaster, but it is not a wood coaster, so. Wood Yo, you coaster. can even hear the guy yell, play back. Ah! Play back a thousand times. Ah! Oh! Oh my gosh. Like, the problem with wood roller coasters is like, Yo, yeah, see, it has that thing where they're, like, stacked like that. Like, what if it just caught on Well, yeah, that's completely true. It could catch on fire, but they usually have multiple fire extinguishers in the station of any wooden coaster and even including Rocky Mountain Construction's hybrid coasters um, because of that problem that it may catch on fire. Fire. Sorry, I'm enjoying this. This feels like I'm there. You ever watch roller coasters in VR? Yes. You you came to my house and we did that one. Oh, what? That's insane. Why is this 29? Why is this 29? not number one? I can't wait to see what number one is. I guess I'll have to watch to the end to see it. I guess you'll have to. Number Whoa. Two, number 28. Seriously, I don't believe Rock and Roller Coaster is the 20th greatest roller coaster in the world, but it, it's okay. So it starts off getting shot. It sounds like we're in a jet engine. Yo, why can't we just have, instead of like having trains to get around, why can't they just build roller coasters everywhere? Yeah, so like... I'm going to skip over this part because it has nothing to do with roller coasters. This is number 27. Oh, they're really high. This ride is Medusa at Six Flags Mech. He called Mexico, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, it's once again, it's a um, Rocky Mountain construction hybrid coaster. Whoa! Oh my gosh. I don't know if I would be able to ride this. That's too fast. That guy's just holding up his hands. Yo, wood coasters are incredible. Not a wood coaster. Oh my god. Yeah, he put his hands down he quick. Did. Oh my god. Hands inside the vehicle, oh, sir. upside down. Hands inside the vehicle. You're going to lose them. <laughs> Where are you going that wood coasters have loops in them? What in God? No standard wood coaster will ever contain a loop unless it is modified in any way. This is a RMC hybrid coaster, like I have said. I know they can't hear me, but still. God's name, am I watching? Wow, that is tall. Yo, pause. There's not a single thing in sight taller than this. Look at that. So there's about to be a giant dip, and then they're going to climb Mount Everest. Wow. Oh, the dip of death. Oh, no. Well, I would black oh, out. No. I would oh, legit no. black out. You, wait, did you hear that guy's voice? He said, oh. oh. This is making me nauseated oh just watching God. this. How do they build stuff like this? It's nice that they're adding a Japanese coaster in here. This is a steel dragon at Nagasaki Spa Land. I don't know if I pronounced Nagasaki right, but. I'm going to call this the red coaster of death. Oh my. What is this? The hyper tunnel of the death star? This is Star Wars. <laughs> no, this is the Incredible Hulk coaster at Universal. Wars. The roller coaster is the beam. It's beaming towards the planet. Oh, this is so cool. You know it's a good roller coaster because I've yet to understand a single thing that's going on. Honestly, you might as well just be in a washing machine because you wouldn't be able to tell the difference. There's no way you can know which way you're turning, which way you're going. You're just bouncing around. Number 22. You are going. What? I'm surprised. They have Fury 325 at number 22. This is considered one of the greatest roller coaster of all time. It's so fast on yeah. this one. Play the, the sound of the video. Like, hear that wind? I want to ride this so bad. Then go to Carowinds. I'm pretty sure you guys live in North Carolina. 
and Carowinds is in Charlotte, so. Oh, the oh, hangers. You know when it's upside down, it's gonna be wild. I love upside down coasters. Whoever. Yep, yeah, this is an inverted coaster called Nemesis at Alton Towers. At first I thought it was a Vacoma SLC, but luckily it isn't. Thought of that was very smart. This is making me tear. I would feel like my legs are gonna get chopped off yeah. every second. It's so close to the ground. Yo, what What if you're like Yao Ming and you ride this? My gut tells me this is gonna be great. Woohoo, another RMC. They do this just to like make you nervous. They're like, let's just move at half a mile an hour. Let's have it make these loud like king, king, king yeah. sounds. They're just like- So it sounds like it's breaking. Out. Yeah. I know this is most likely a joke, but yeah, that cling, cling, cling is the chain pulling the cart to the top of the hill. There's no teleportation on roller coasters. <laughs> you hear just shaking? What is that sound? I don't know if I would ride this one. Yo, it's going so fast. Oh, it's now just going to chill down. upside down. Now for you're a just while. upside down. That's fine. Wait, are you not upside down? I can't tell. Are we upside down or are we not upside down? Another upside down one. It's going to launch him up. There it goes. Look at that. Oh! 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 Yo! Woohoo! Wicked Twister from Cedar Point, the coaster capital of the world. What? What? Oh, okay. wait, we're going back. Oh, this is one of those backwards forwards roller coasters. Windy dindy ones. Yeah, they do oh. the, the old upsy downsy. This is the one we should have rode. Oh back and my forth. gosh. No. I'd be like, yo, let me off. Make it stop. Yo, I'm All right, I'm going to skip the next two because this is taking way too long and also they're not very interesting. Oh. They're getting some speed. Look at how fast those bars are flying by. Man, look at it. It's. So this is Banshee at Kings Island in Mason, Ohio. Whipping it now. Oh, the double loop. Is there a triple loop? Oh, how about a corkscrew? I didn't know that was called a corkscrew. Mm -hmm. Thank you. You're welcome. All right, so this is the 10th coolest roller coaster in the world. This one is- Let's go, Gatekeeper, my favorite coaster personally. I love this ride. Cedar Point, let's go. It's definitely like really pretty looking. It's a nice fast moving ride. It takes up a lot of space. It's got a lot of cool stuff. It's on a beach. All that's cool. But in terms of epicness, we've seen better. We've seen better. Hopefully number nine doesn't disappoint. How about jet engines? Mock speed. If they're not careful, they're gonna fly to- Holy crap, look at that. What's that's terrible. King Dakar at Six Flags Great Adventure. I think this is the tallest roller coaster in the world. Fine. What are you supposed to do with that? I bet that feels like you're about to get launched. This is it's called airtime. Vertical and horizontal airtime. No, positive and negative airtime. One of those two sets I can't remember at the moment. Crazy. Yo, this makes those trees look tiny. That's when you know you're up high, when the trees look like broccoli. <laughs> oh! Which one? Intimidator 305 at King's Dominion. This coaster, I want to ride it so bad. You don't even know how much I want to ride this. Oh, this coaster looks so fun. Where are you going to go? There's so many different ways. This looks like McDonald's. No joke, I've ridden this ride. This is at King's Dominion, and this roller coaster is known for making people black out. When you go down, you're going down so fast. It's like your eyes are open, but everything just starts getting slowly black. This is the last roller coaster I've ever ridden. Like, I, I never want to ride a roller coaster again after this one. Uh, this looks... Uh, I know some people may have weak stomachs, and I know the coaster is called Intimidator, but... I feel that coasters should never intimidate you. If you feel like that the coaster is too scary or too thrilling for you, then just go down to a different level of coaster and maybe try something weaker. I'm going to skip to the top three. Top three. <gasps> I don't know what I'm looking at. It's what you're looking at is X1, a three-dimensional coaster at Six Flags Great Adventure. But what? Wait. I don't understand Are, what's going on. Wait, they're they backwards? pivot. No, the whole, the seat spins and everything. Wait. It's on a ju just first and now he's last. Thank you, Bobby. This deserves the number three slot. This has creativity out the wazoo. All I got to say is number two better be epic. Wait, yeah. so the roller coaster is connecting? It's getting you locked into position and they're just sitting here waiting to be dropped. I would never trust a roller coaster that connects itself. It has to lock in.
Never. And then you what? go underground. That was cool. I mean, honestly, the music's kind of killing it for me. It's cool, scary, terrifying, fast, epic, but just because of the music, I would say it doesn't deserve number two. What if we put this music in there? All right, now it deserves number two. Okay. And the moment you've all been waiting for, the coolest roller coaster ever. If you made it this far, you're officially cool. Oh, look at that full parking lot. Nice. That's how you know it's number one, it's baby. Good. That's a big drop. Right, big drop. What you're looking at right now is Cannibal at Lagoon in Salt Lake City, Utah. Underground. Underground okay. like that. We've seen that stuff before, but it's off to a good start. Loop-de-loop -loop into the Swirl, screw. We like down. that. Still maintaining speed. Oh, a little bit of a screw into an upside down. Swirl. All right, another swirl. I don't know, man. I, I need to get impressed fast. I mean, it's got cool artwork, but I don't know if that's enough to make it number one. I mean, I don't hear anybody screaming in terror. It is very pretty, but like pretty don't matter. That ain't it, man. I like pretty, but it doesn't make me pee my pants. I'll be honest. Number three was better than the number one. Number three. I'll say it. I'll say it. Call the roller coaster gods. I don't care. Shout out to all the people that recorded these roller coasters footage. Obviously, we're making fun of the roller coasters, but to the people who actually filmed these, we appreciate you. Check them out. Goodbye. Okay, now that the video has ended, I just wanted to say that I'm not hating on Mr. Beast or Chris in the, um at all. And I don't expect them to know this kind of stuff. And even though I was kind of going against what they were saying and like nitpicking at what they were saying. Um, I don't mean anything to the words them, and I have not lost any respect for them. S uh, they do many great things, so, yeah. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.